it was time for an upgrade. So I replaced the microwave oven in my truck with the Glance microwave, convection oven, and air fryer. Let's talk about it, coming up. You'll want to stay tuned to the end because I've got a giveaway at the end of this particular video. The unit I'm talking about is a microwave plus air fryer plus convection oven. It says that its capacity is a 900 watt 0.9 cubic foot capacity microwave. That doesn't mean it only uses 900 watts. This is important to know because most of us are using inverters. It actually uses 1,350 watts when used as a microwave, 1,450 watts when used as a convection oven. So you will want to have your truck idling and probably on high idle. Quick look at the box as it has an Anst air fry technology, air frying with intense heat and circulated air, true convection oven, even roasting and baking, auto cook and auto reheat, combination speed cooking using the microwave and convection together. It comes with some accessories, an air fry kit, a baking and roasting pan, and a glass turntable like all microwaves have. And there's some nice pictures of what you can cook in the microwave slash air fryer slash convection oven. It fits perfectly in the spot where the microwave oven would go in our trucks, the Kenworth T680. As an air fryer, I decided to test it out using a Rida Extra Crispy Fast Food French Fries. Set the things in there, pressed the function key. They actually have a function key set for French fries. And it came out looking excellent and tasting awesome. Remember, no oil was used when I made these. To test it as a microwave oven, I did some pizza rolls. I put some pizza rolls in there on a paper towel on the glass tray. And I set them to cook, and they cook just like the microwave that was in the truck before cooked. Perfectly ready to eat. Of course, the test for any microwave oven is how does it cook popcorn? Stuck a bag of popcorn in there, so pressed the popcorn button. Two minutes and 40 seconds later, I had popcorn. Nearly every kernel cooked. Next, I tested out the ability of it to bake. I put a piece of chicken in, boneless, skinless chicken, and I baked the skinless, boneless, skinless chicken with a little butter on top and some seasoning, and this is how it came out. It was fantastic. I love this thing. I'm going to be using it a lot. This is my new go-to cooking item. All right, I said I had something to give away, and I do. I took the old microwave out of my truck. That microwave was used for a few months. It's in clean and good condition. Whoever walks up to me at a terminal, at a truck stop, and says, hey, I saw your video, and I'd like to have your microwave, gets the microwave. It's that simple. Not gonna have to look it up, not gonna have to ship it to anybody, not gonna be any contest, you don't have to buy anything. All you gotta do is just walk up and say, hey, Tom, can I have your old microwave? And you certainly can. It'll be riding around in the truck with me underneath the bunk until somebody asks for it. 